Assalamualaikum. So here is a video on how we can solve um the BJT circuit using voltage transfer characteristic. All right. So voltage transfer characteristic is a graphical approach to um to to visualize the operation of your BJT circuit and the state of the uh, BJT. So, um, voltage transfer characteristic is actually a graph, okay, that has V out and V in. So, it will uh, display the um, V out correspond to the V in. So it means your you can um uh, draw the point of v out in for whatever v in values that you put in the circuit okay so in this uh example um consider that um r c is four k four kilo ohm and r b is hundred kilo ohm and uh, we are required uh, to draw the voltage transfer characteristic with uh, given that the value of VB on is 0 0.7, beta is 120 and your VC saturation is 0 0.2. Okay, so first of all, as usual, um, this is a, we need to identify the configuration first and it is a NPN BJT and it's a common emitter configuration so we know that across here is vce and mm, the output will be equal to vce so v out will be equal to your vce okay because there's no resistor here re and uh, there's some um, important um, condition that we need to know that bjt um, works in active region when your V in is greater than VBE on, all right. Otherwise, otherwise it will be in cut off region, right? When V in is less than VBE on, okay. And then given here the the condition for the circuit is at um. The saturation region is when your V out is 0 0.2. So, here we don't know what is the V in. Okay, so that's what we need to find in this uh, question. Okay, so you need to write the KVL first as usual. So, to solve this um, problem is, uh, first we start with the KVL at input loop. Where's the input loop? Input loop is at the BE between the BE terminal. Okay, so here we can write minus V in. Current flows here is IB, right? IB current. So minus IB RB. This is the volt uh, plus voltage drop at um RB resistor. And plus the built-in voltage, VBE, and this is equal to zero. Equation one. And then um, KVL and input loop, out output loop, or the between the CE terminal. So it will be minus V plus. And V plus here is equal to 5 volt. Okay. So maybe we should just write 5 volt. Okay. 5 volts. Plus IC RC. Plus V out. Because we know that, that the VCE is equal to V out. So we can just straight away write V out. Equal to 0. And this is second equation. So from, from these two. We can um find um one relationship that can equate these two equation one and two together, which is IB. We know that for the fact that 
IC is equal to beta IB. So we can rearrange this equation to find IB value. IB is V in minus VBE over RB. And here we can write IB is equal to 5 minus V out over beta RC. Okay. So if we equate this IB from equation 1 and IB from equation 2, we can rewrite the whole equation to be V in minus 0 0.7, which is the V beyond value, over RB is 100K, equal to 5 minus V out over um, 100 20 multiply with 4 kilo ohm okay okay in this equation we already have v in and v out and given the condition here that we need to fulfill is v out or when when the v out is saturation saturated we need to find what is the value of your v in or in other term what is the V in value that drive the BJT into saturation? So, we know that here is 0 0.7 during saturation. So, you can find V in when VCE is 0 0.2, okay, will be equivalent to 0 0.7, okay. How to find this? You just, how to find that value is, we just include um, 5 minus 0 0.2 124k multiply with 100k okay and then this whole value you add 0 0.7 so you will get 1.7 so what we can do here we need to um transfer all this information okay uh, to this graph okay and we know that um to turn on v in must be greater than 0 0.7 it means that okay it means that v in less than 0 0.7 Transistor will be in cut off region. Okay. Next, we found out that um, the V in is 0 0.7 will drive the BJT into saturation region. So let's say you just plot 0 0.7 here. And with this 0 0.7, we get V up equal to 0 0.2. And at this point onwards is a saturation region. Hence, you can draw your plot that starting this point onwards, the BJT will be saturated. And um, now we need to know which what is the point. Um, for the cut off region so when cut off what is the value of your v out so during cut off no current flow because ib will be zero right cut off ib will be zero it means cut off means the bjt will be totally off and when ib zero there will be no no ic current and when there's no ic current your v out will be equal to the supply so here the supply is five volt okay and what and this condition will occur, the BJT will off until the V in value is greater than your 0 0.7 here. Okay. And once the V in value here is greater than 0 0.7, the BJT will go into active region. So this 
is what the voltage transfer the voltage transfer characteristic will look like here is a cutoff here is the active region and this is the saturation region okay so that's all and we will discuss about um, other voltage transfer characteristics in other example in other videos